utilities have to continue to provide a reliable and resilient operation. It must be safe and it must be affordable. They need to have real-time visibility on their assets. The need for control is there. When I reflect on what has changed during this time, it's the impact of more frequent natural disasters. The once in a generation storm is happening every single year, sometimes more than once a year. And the grid needs to be up. It also needs to withstand some of the pressures from cybersecurity. Also from the aggressive clean energy goals. So as you think about the changing landscape that the utilities need to support, a modern grid needs modern communications. You need to have a private lane that you're able to control, that you're not competing with other users on a network. Wireless is a very versatile type application. It allows you to connect to devices that are hard to reach. Um, sometimes you have mobile workforce, so there's a versatility that you get from a wireless network. A private wireless network requires the right technology like LTE and also the right spectrum band. LTE, which is a global standard that they're able to leverage a large ecosystem. A wireless network is also a key component of a communication strategy. Utilities that are investing in private networks see a value in being able to quantify their investment and the benefits that it brings. They're able to match that with their communications network strategy. As they look at the future evolution of the grid, they're also leveraging the ability to scale their private network, not just for the use cases of now, but what their grid would look like we into the future. So you can't have all of these new applications, the clean energy, the resilient and cyber secure grid without having a modern communications platform.